A local woman is making a big artful splash. Her massive murals are showing up all over the tri-state. Fox 19 Stefano DP Trantonio joins us in our studio with more on where you can see her giant size canvases. Step. Kim and Dan, her name is Tammy Stevens, and chances are you've seen her work, like this double piano uh, mural that's right here in the front lobby at Fox 19. And your kids may have even played on her art. Like the long brush strokes on this massive canvas. I like to have the gradations happen in long lines. You are immediately drawn into Tammy Stevens' art. I love to pull people in on what I'm working on and, and let them also learn from the experience and I learn from the experience when I include others in my work. She loads up several colors and then drags them across to create the illusion of water and light at the Thousand Hands Playground downtown. I just love to see how the light plays along the, uh, the ripples of the water and how the reflections change with the ripples. Now this is Tammy's original sketch of the mural you see behind me. And you'll notice looking at the original concept, there are a few things that are missing. Like this dock in front, painted as water instead to better weather years of climbing. As we worked on the uh, Thousand Hands Playground, the whole focus was that every child can play there. No matter what their abilities. And I wanted to include a handicapped person, um, you know, there in the 40s. They, they were there, and they were all, you know, in our society, and that is exactly what we want everybody to be a part of. These kids probably have no idea they're scaling a work of art. At Notre Dame Academy in Park Hills, Kentucky, three wall-sized murals mimic the lone window in the workout room and feature all of the school sports. Well, we did a few body sketches, actually. It was really fun. Um, we took a bunch of paper and laid it out on the floor, and they laid down on there, and we drew around each other. Paint skirts on. Seniors Alexander Koblitz and Jordan Hill helped out. It was actually not as hard as I thought, especially with just the background. It was pretty big. I mean, like doing the background and the basic colors and stuff. And having enough paint is a big thing. Yes. Yeah. And at the Remke Market in Fort Mitchell. They let me d redesign the whole store. A slice of surreal life. <laughs> Behind the bakery counter, real peppers blend in with the salad bar or the Roman arches along the side wall. And it's just a feeling of community. That's our hometown area here, and that's where we want to um, want you to look at that and think, yeah, that's my, that's my city. Some of those murals have taken months to complete. Those two girls worked on the walls at uh, Notre Dame for two months. Tammy says she's happy to see scuff marks on the playground mural. It means the kids are enjoying her art. And it was a lot of fun. Well, she seems like she's just loaded with talent and a nice person to boot. Our, our lobby, the panels in our lobby are fantastic. I'm going to put a link on our website so you can check out more of her work right here on fox19.com.